So that's a uh, definite no on the Shere Khan thing then, huh? <laughs> hey guys, what's going on? Your host for this LP. I am AMF1534 and I just threw myself right into an open rose bush. Let's play some more Donkey Kong Country 2, uh, shall we? In our last episode, we started up one of my favorite levels in the entire game, of which goes by the name of Bramble Blast. Blasting, you know, thus the name of all these barrels and getting shot around everywhere. I've had a lot of fails today, of which, you know, I lost my iPod last night. That wasn't very much fun. Um, so I really hope I find that. I'd really suck if I couldn't find that. Um, then I was supposed to work today, which I didn't think that I was supposed to, because I usually never work on those days. Oh my dear god. What in the world is going on right now? Jeez. But yeah, I like never work. I never worked Thursdays. And so I figured, you know, I'll, you know, I'll go stay out till all, all hours of the morning doing god knows what. And there's our DK coin. That's pretty sweet. Um... And so I get a call from my, you know, my manager at about 10.30 this morning, saying, Hey, you know you were supposed to work today, right? I was like, I have no idea what you're talking about. It's a Thursday. And she's like, I know, but you're supposed to be here. Not any rush or anything, but you should probably think about coming to work today. And I was like, oh, no. That sounds awful. Of which, for whatever reason, I was later awarded the day off. For reasons that I don't know. I really don't know. And I made that sound like I won like a court ruling or something. That was really weird. Um, anywho, yeah, so that was like a, a mini epic win, actually. But I have to work tomorrow, which was supposed to be my day off this week, I, I guess. So it just ends up balancing itself out. I had like a redistribution of my work schedule. I really need to get the end of this place. Oh my god. Okay, we got it. Yes. I still need seven more before we can go into our bonus stage. But anyways. Ooh, there's the G. Cog? Rooster Cogburns. Ah, there we go. Yeah, any effing ways. And then, um... I was gonna go get some food, but then I realized that my car battery is dead, and that totally sucks. Um, but then my parents brought me food. Because they went and got Mexican food, which is awesome, because I just ate some, and it was delicious. So, a lot of my epic fails today have been, like, totally balanced out by epic wins. Anywho, it's time for Cudgel's Contest. Wait, isn't that the dude that... Isn't that the dude's name down here? Oh, no, that's Clubba, never mind. Yeah, Cudge, Cudgel. This son of... This son of a bitch. Okay. You'll see quite a strange resemblance here. Does he not look exactly like his twin brother, Clubba? Well, it's because I would guess that they are twin brothers. Of which this one is probably the more douchey of them. Try not to be on the ground at the same time that he lands. And yes, the objective, obviously. Avoid him while he's, you know, doing his phasing in and out thing. Oh god! Try not to get yourself in a corner either. It's not a very smart idea. And then throw loaded barrels of TNT right into his face because we all know that you can withstand multiple... Yikes. I walked right into it for God's sakes. I deserved it. And how did he not die? He just jumped onto a, a crate of TNT for God's sakes. Okay. That just doesn't happen. But yes, this actually can be a very, very easy fight, provided that you do not corner yourself. Just don't do it. Oh my god, are you serious? <laughs> I am just not doing well today. I'm just not. That's all there is to it. I'm not doing well. Alright, we're gonna do this. We're gonna get out of this goddamn swamp, because my favorite zone in this entire game is next up on the list here. Oh, I can't wait. It's gonna be so much fun! And you guys are gonna love it, too. P.S. Um... No. Oh, no! God! Um... Do not bother asking me about what the Shere Khan thing was that I was talking about in the beginning of this video, because I'm not gonna tell you. It's just too 
too awkward to speak about. Ooh. Here's where it gets a little bit trickier. No! God damn it. I wasn't trying to fly. I was trying to, you know, jump and then do a spin move. But, you know, I'm getting myself into trouble here. This is so much harder than it needs to be. Or I'm making it look so much harder than it needs to be. This is like the, the, the easiest boss battle in this game besides the first one. Because all he does is he just jumps and then he comes down and then he gives you a barrel and you hit him with it. I mean, it's not hard. But I'm definitely making it look hard because I've died enough times on it already. Just run to one side, run to the other side, and then you're good because it'll swing and then... I don't know why he would willingly supply you with the tools of which to destroy him with, but that's his own thing. Maybe he wants to die. Maybe he's like one of those people that really is like super suicidal. Maybe he's having an emo moment. I mean, look at him. He is wearing the tight pants. That's step one. And then he wants to be hurt. He's, you know, he just wants it. All right, here we go. I think we might, we might have a, uh, we might have a clean sweep of this this time. I think we're gonna do all right. I think we only have to hit him two more times and then we're good. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yes. All right. Here we go. Kind of thirsty. Kind of need to pee too. Probably not gonna do either of those things right now though, because I'm in the middle of a very intriguing boss battle that I really want to get done with, so we can go to the best place in the entire game. Yes, he's dead! Holy shit! Ooh, dirty water. It's like Mexican water. And there we go. Zone 3 is complete, and now we're going to the best place in this entire game. I swear to God. Crazy Kremland is completely awesome. So here we go. Ooh, yes! Oh my god, this is so great. I'm so happy right now. Let's go to the Hornet Hole. Sounds very oddly sexual, just like a lot of other things, even though I don't know what would be sexual about bee porn. Yes, I said it. Bee porn. Weird, huh? So yeah, you can jump and stick on the honey while you eat some. Ooh, I'm going to eat it. Actually, honey does sound pretty good right now. So if you go up this way, in the, in the words of the very the very wise man, H.C. Bailey. You will find a secret passage. I like that guy. H.C. Bailey is pretty cool. So it's one of these things again, very similar to one of the other ones from, I think it was Zone 1. You just gotta take the chest that's sitting inside of another chest, inside of another chest, inside of another chest, and you gotta hit him with it. Hopefully you can break it apart quickly enough. Yeah. And there's your coin. Holy crap. Mm. I've got indigestion. P.S. Listen to the music for the uh, the music track for this place. It's super awesome. Not to mention, before I get ahead of myself, look at the graphics. Like, look at the the background for this place. They have like honey coming down in the foreground with the honeycomb with the live like bees in the back. It's just fucking awesome. I don't know how you could possibly, like, pick out anything bad about this game ever in your life. And, like, this this song gets so triumphant. There's definitely a way up there. I don't remember how to do it, though. Maybe if we go up this way, we'll probably get it. Um, okay. Go, oh, oh, jeez. I never envisioned, you know, honeycombs being this big. Or they'd have barrels and, you know, those things in them. I can't think of the name of that thing right now. Somebody help me out here. Oh. There's our K. Ooh, we can go up here, too. Sweet. I don't remember what's in here, though. But I guess we're going to find out. Ooh, two lives. And now we have MTV amount of lives. For those of you that are at least Comcast users, I don't If you're... If you have a uh, direct TV, then it's obviously not going to make sense. It's channel 63 on my uh, TV set. It may not be the same for people in other places outside of Oregon, so who knows? Ugh. I like how those things don't make noises when they die. They're just like, oh, yep, I'm dead. 
Everything else at least just makes some type of grunt that's... Ugh. Oh my god, yeah! We get this guy again! This guy's super awesome. Whoa! <laughs> I'm seeing things. Let's uh, break her open. Oh, we can't shoot things? that have to break it open, huh? Let's see if we can go up. Let's see if we have any type of uh, thing here. We don't. Alright, let's get in our barrel of awesomeness. Yeah. Yeah, why not? I don't even know why I would even bother doing this, but whatever. <laughs> what can I say? I'm I'm a medallion whore. I gotta go after him. What do you do? I don't even know why I did that either. Oh, no, no, you don't. You get back over here. I mean, it's not weird or anything that I'm riding on a spider that's wearing eight pairs of shoes that spits out webs and can stand on them. Nothing weird about that. This is really making me want to have Popeye's chicken. Not really because of the... I mean, bees do not remind me in any way of chicken, but the honey does. Because Popeye's and honey with their biscuits is nothing short of a culinary delight. Alright, here we go. At least we're back on track here. That's right, I caught you at the curveball. You have been hit by my massive curveball of doom. There we go. We have gotten the bee. Time to be real. I wonder if there's anything down there. You think there's anything down here? For our enjoyment. I really hope so, otherwise this is going to be an absolute huge waste. Yep, that would have been a huge waste. That's probably why they put that hook there, so that you can't do something stupid like that. Enough backtracking, though. We need, we need to go... We need to progress here. Progressing is important. Oh! Jesus. Why do I not recall this area? Probably because I think it's a secret. It's exactly what it is. It's a secret. That's where that DK coin's gonna be. All right. Yeah, baby. Whoop. <laughs> All right. I am yet to find an actual bonus stage in here. That wow. That was quite the uh, formidable thing there. Yo, no. Get back here, you bastard. No. <laughs> no, he's gone because of my insolence. That sucks. There's not even anything over here. Why did I even bother doing that? It's like the stupidest thing I've done all day. It's so retarded. And I needed to go up there, too. God damn it all. Way to go, Adam. Way to go. If you're wondering why I killed myself, well, I'll tell you. Did it on purpose. I want my damn spider. I want him now. And I'm going to go back and get him. At least it's not a very long way to go. We can go right there and get him. So it's actually not... You son of a whore. You get back here. You get your dirty whorish mouth back here right now. Shit, shit, shit. How do you get caught in that? How does that even work? How do they even get him down there and make it impossible for me to even get to that? That's just retarded. <sighs> you know. You know how it is. Oh no, 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 no. Jeez. Throw him up there with your hair, woman. Alright. Here we go. I don't know why still doing this. Should have been done a long time ago. I have wasted so much time. It's alright. We're gonna get we're gonna get done with this level before I call it quits for the day. Since I am right around that time limit that I don't really have since, you know, they kinda took those away as of late. 
Yes. All right. Now let's go back up here again. If I don't fall. Mm hmm. Don't need to go down there again because we don't need to. But we do need to go up here. It's a little pipsqueak pioneer. Because the businessman in me quivers. I want to know if what I was thinking of was up here or if I was just imagining things. And I was not imagining things because there's a bonus stage right there. And we're going to find the token. With our giant spider with shoes on. And we just have to make ourselves some webbed platforms. And that was really not hard at all. Definitely probably not worth three or four minutes of me mulling around trying to get to that point. But we got the coin, we need the coin, and so it actually ended up being okay. I love the noise that those webs make when they come out. Or the ones that you shoot, the... Ooh, another thing up here. What could we have up here? Could it be something good? I hope so. It'd be really cool if it was another bonus stage. Which it doesn't look like it is. Ooh. Where are we going? We're gonna go this way. I don't think there's probably anything over there, because there just isn't. I would not want to do this level without the spider guy. Alright. Surprisingly, all of my dying, I've actually managed to make, or like, actually have positive amounts of lives during this current video. Because I think I started with 62. And I've died at least like three times. Alright, well there's the Kong College lady. Don't need to go talk to her though. Oh my god, I love this level so much. But we're not going to do it right now because we are out of time. So, I thank you for watching. This is your host, AMF1534, saying... Stick around for the next episode of Let's Play Donkey Kong Country 2, and we're going to do Target Terror, which is awesome, and you're going to see why if you don't know. If you already know, then you know exactly how awesome this is going to be, so I don't know why I'm talking so fast, but I will see you guys next time. See you later. Goodbye.